We're gonna head to Red Rock Canyon, go on a short hike with the dogs. It's one of the things Jen wanted to do for her birthday. Recognizes Julia. <laughs> She's saying Hi, hello. Baby. Hi. All right, going on a little hike. Oh, Julia, come on. Woo-hoo! She's like, Always an adventure here. The dogs load it in the car. Romeo likes to try to come up front. Hopefully with Jen in the back, he doesn't need to. Supposed to be free entry today. It's not that crowded so far, which is good. Pulling up to the visitor center parking. And we're going to do a uh, trail right near here because of the dogs. We don't want to go too far. This is a little crowded. It'll be a long walk with the dogs stopping everywhere to smell. Oh, Romeo. <laughs> oh, Romeo. He's looking, he's got a big ass smile on his face. Romeo. So we're going to go to the right of the visitor center. She said, you'll see the picnic area. Go right through the picnic area and then go on the trail there. Canyon dedication walkway. Now yeah, this is the trail here it looks like. Moen Kopi Trail System is what it's called. Moen Kopi Trail, two miles easy. That's what we're gonna do, two miles easy. All right, we're gonna turn around here because I don't think this is a loop. We didn't do enough research and uh, there's a bunch of people coming the opposite direction. And with the dogs, this is probably gonna be about two miles when we get back. It's very quiet out here. You do hear your footsteps in the dirt gravel. happy but his tail was down his tail was up and now his tail went up I think when he saw the parking area that's almost over they were doing great first trail you ready to drink now Romeo yeah drink up good job Romeo you wait until it was done to drink so we're back at the visitor center we did this hike mainly because it was a training hike for these guys. Plus we don't have to go through the whole scenic loop to get out. You can get out right down here. Visitor center does have restrooms. There's also restrooms down at the additional parking for the visitor center. This is always the trouble when Jen goes somewhere without the dogs because they're trying to get to her even though we're here. They don't care. Romeo, Juliet, mommy's coming. No, you can't go in there. Yeah, they're tired. That, that, that hike, that hike. Them out, I think. just wants to shade. They definitely could have done the full thing. Nah, yeah, I think we turned around at the right spot. They're training. Yeah, because they're tired. Are you tired? Yeah. We're going to head to downtown Summerlin, get something to eat, walk the dogs around. You can't do this back in New Jersey. Walk your dogs in a little downtown shopping area. Or at least a nice downtown shopping area. Well, that's why Henderson is one of the top places, dog cities. Well, this isn't Henderson, this is Las Vegas, but the whole Las Vegas area. The wind blowing you. <laughs> Wet mouth. There's all this pure hair. Gonna eat at Earl's Sandwich. At Earl's Sandwich with the doggies on the patio. Our roll of sandwich was $34.78. Got three sandwiches, two of them combos. Okay, it's good drinks. like I remember. Josh got mac and cheese. I can tell it's going to be very good. Yeah. Our roll club. Jen gets the French dip. Josh got the ham and cheese, but just ham and cheese. Romeo's making sure we know he's there so we can have some food. Oh, but it's a water feature at downtown Summerlin. 
little bridge. That'll do it for today. We're gonna head back to the apartment. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, share. No, you still gonna do it right. Someday I'll get it.